Welcome to this Tobacco University video. And if you're looking at this video, you're probably looking at germinating your cannabis seeds in Rockwell or Oasis. And Tobacco University here is to provide you with some helpful tips and tricks to increase the odds of your success. Let's get into the video specifics. Well, first off, when we're looking at germinating seeds, we have to keep in mind that we have some basics uh, to be sure we're adhering to. We want to make sure the seed is from a certified source. We're keeping the temperature within the accepted ranges, moisture level, target level, air percentage, depth, and light all need to be adhered to for the basic environment to help ensure the environment is supportive of basic seed germination properties. Now, why would you use Rockwell or Oasis? Well, natural properties of both are conducive to early plant establishment. The, both materials hold water well while still providing roots adequate air exchange, allowing them to respire and essentially breathe. And they often come in space efficient trays with individual cubes per cut, which allow for very efficient production on both a small scale as well as a large scale. So what are some specifics, particularly to Rockwell? Um, you want to typically soak your Rockwell first before planting seeds in it. Sometimes this may require soaking uh, in water that's pH tested. And if it's not required, it might be a good idea and should be something pretty quick and easy for you to do. Typically, the small cubes are recommended no matter where the seedling will be going for the rest of the growth cycle uh, because they can be put into larger blocks as we see here. Common uh, used example would be the Grodan OA cubes. Um, they're uh, kind of a name brand, but they're very established, particularly in the Rockwell um, arena there for uh, propagation. Now, as the plant grows, we want to keep this in mind that as the plant's growing, the cubes are designed to fit into larger blocks. As we can see here, it's a small cube. They can easily be placed into this larger block as a pre-cut hole to allow during the trans. Uh, planting process, minimal root disturbance. This is where Grodan uh, Block Delta, for example, they um, sell a series of different sizes that all fit into one another that allow for that natural progression um, for a growing plant. Now, both substrates, this is again for Rockwell and Oasis, are easily put into trays for easy mass production in a small area. You can grow a lot of plants in a very small square footage, which is advantageous. Leave one planting spot empty though if you're using a tray, in, particularly in the middle, so that the water in the tray can be properly determined to make sure you're not under or over watering um, your newly developing seedlings. And again, this is true for both um, substrates. They can also be used for clones as well as seeds, but here it provides you hopeful with some quick kind of general um, tips for germinating your seeds in either Rockwell or Oasis.